You have something else? It's Hunter, yeah. my second favorite zombie superhero. Who is your first? Tony, on two hours of sleep. So, oh boy. what do you need? I have well, you've seen me on two hours of sleep. Sure, ask away. Is it akin to that one stream you did yeah. of Chrono one in Trigger? Yes. yes. Who were you before you became Captain Marvel? Air Force pilot. I used to fly the unfriendly skies before I was attached to the space program. And back then, I was entirely human. You are not entirely human? Not since I uncovered actual for real aliens. There was an accident with some alien tech that rewrote my DNA, and now I'm half Cree. The fuck is a Cree? I've never heard of the Cree. <laughs> Neither had I. They have a space empire. They're, they are a massive space empire, in fact. And you've been alive. They're the Klingons? Not Why did quite. Carol Danvers become Captain Marvel. Well, first I was Miss Marvel for a while. I found myself involved in a conflict between alien species, Kree and Skrulls. I got too close to a device called the Psyche Magnetron, and it completely altered me. A Kree soldier known as Marvell felt responsible for what happened and took me under his wing. Oh, what a he was jokes a hero from, uh, in his own right, and we Captain fought beside Marvel each movie. other for years. He's gone now, but I took the name Captain Marvel as a tribute to what he stood for. Since then, it only I've took you like 50 own. years to take that name, but hey. Your strength is hard for me to fathom. With all this gamma weirdness keeping Banner in Banner form, I'm Earth's mightiest <laughs> Avenger. <laughs> Once Thor realized the Hulk was in a class of his own, he was not happy oh. to be in third place. Oh god, the reason why he Captain Marvel was me to arm wrestling so little in. Loses. He's much in, less uh, salty since game. I started calling him Asgard's Mightiest Avenger. Mm -hmm. How powerful so, so would you powerful say you are? So powerful they did not know what to do with her. Mm. When someone says we need to call in the big guns, they're talking about me. Just don't say it in front of Bruce. I the mean, it's kind of like the Superman stronger, problem no question, a lot of writers have. He doesn't have my yeah, precision, and patience, that's one of the problems I have with the Justice League in general, happens. because a lot of the heroes in the power. Justice League and it does not seem are in Superman's good. weight class, so it's just I like, do why do you need a team of, like, of all of... Granted. No, nothing should realistically cause a problem for this group. Arrogance is like punching at least, at least with the Avengers, you have, like... Like, Avengers in the early days, you had, like, Tell Thor as Avengers. the Superman equivalent, but everybody sure. kind of what had a role. And X-Men, before weird shit started going on with them, I loved them because, like, have you been each character oh, had a decade. specific power Still and thus a believe. specific job. so busy dealing with one crisis or another, it's hard to mark the time. My coffee tally puts me just shy of 20,000, excluding the cups I forgot to track. That's more than the hundred cups that Fry drank! What are your thoughts on your fellow Avengers? I'm curious how that tally's against Griffin. I'm with the team for a reason. <laughs> I believe in what we do. All of us do. Yeah, when I'm when sure we were at William we'll and Mary, she him. basically yeah. never slept. I doubt his commitment. Dear God. He and Banner used to fight like cats in a sack. Thankfully, they seem to be past that. And I can't think of anyone better to deal with a mystical enemy than Doctor Strange. He's a little out of sorts right now, what with being pushed out of his home, but he'll adjust. Do you think your team can find common ground with the Midnight Suns? Look, I try not to get involved in politics. I'll just a uh, work with anyone strange, who gets the job done. You left the milk out of again. Do all the Avengers feel the same? Can he just send it into no some comment. weird portal and make it fresh again? Thank you, Carol. Anytime. Maybe. Yeah, if you find What's the time, this? This isn't cow's milk. Out. You don't want to know. I will consider that. It's of course. moose milk. Also with most milk. I, ha I milk. have, I have had pizza made with cheese, oh. made with moose milk. The cost of moose milk from the cosmic desert. I feel like we left things unfinished, Hunter. If you're free, I'd like to talk. I was gonna say you snapped at us for a ridiculous reason that I don't even quite understand. Because we went past your wards. She oh had the God. library sealed off for a reason that she didn't want to talk about. Yeah. And by bypassing it, we kind of, uh, 
we kind of undermine the authority she tries to keep around here. We'd explain why we went in there, but we can't because yeah. our because our friend our ghost friend is like, no, please don't tell her about don't me yet. Me in suspense. How are you enjoying the library? I thought we were past that. We are, but I'm still allowed to be annoyed with you. And I expect a bit of pushback from the others, but not from you, Hunter. Why not? When have I ever made things easy for you? You had your moments, few and far between, but that's exactly my point. You know what that place, what she meant to me, and you did it anyway. So did we want to go light or dark side? I thought we were going light. Okay. It's been a while. The if fun of actually only recorded this about once you, a month. I would have waited. It was not my intention to defy or hurt you. Hurt, no. Defy, maybe. At the same time, I know I haven't been very open with you about everything that's happened. At least we are talking now. Silence between us would only make things worse. You're right about that. We have bigger things to worry about. Like the mouthy alien tormenting Spider-Man as we speak. He did risk himself for us without hesitation. Venom shouldn't be here. We owe him Spider-Man shouldn't be here either, but Spider-Man gets I everywhere. The entire team is in agreement. It's only a matter right of now, tracking video's not up yet. I would just Tell follow the trail gets of everywhere as well. But he doesn't get as everywhere as he once did, sure just because we'll with something. Marvel Comics were trying to push the things they had the movie rights to. And that's so why X-Men has gotten weird in the past decade. Fucking ruined beast, god damn it, god son of a trap. Weird as in they've lost the point. Yes! The, you, you said it, I didn't. Mm -hmm. <laughs> But you were absolutely correct. Mm -hmm. And the comic of I think it's X-Men Green. Well, this is a case of um, that one X-Men, the case of going on a basic one eco terrorist, and it's are we supposed to be for them, against them? What the hell's someone doing on he doing here? You shall be better than this. You're siding with an eco terrorist. Like, like, the big story arc for the past, God, I want to say five years, like, oh, the X-Men made their own separate nation from the rest of the world, and it's, like, mutant supremacy, and I'm like, X-Men was all about inclusion. That was the point of it. You kind of lost the thread a little, guys. And I think we had a, yeah, it's all a show basically basically said it. Story where they don't include Deadpool, which kind of makes sense since uh, he's kind of insufferable at the times. And he tried to take a flower of him when he left. They beat him up trying to, for him trying to take that flower out of the place, if I recall right. Yeah. Okay. So, we are now being introduced to general missions. So you have two types of missions. You have general missions and story missions. Story missions will advance plot, and the hunter has to go on them. That that always happens. Mm -hmm. General missions will pop up, and anyone can go on them. But they don't. But they do give you rewards, but they don't advance the story. Okay, so they're like grinding missions. They're like grinding missions. Yes. Okay. But you can still only go on one mission per day. So whatever mission you pick, when you're done with it, that's it for the day, and you have to do stuff at the Abbey. Okay. Like flashbacks to three houses. I, I mean, it's kind of like how Engage worked, too. Engage so just look, worked. We have, two, we have two general missions here. And I which, see the big... Which give us Gamma Quill Artifact, Gamma Quill and Credits, and we have a story mission called Spider-Mans. Spider-Mans! So, there will be times when you do not have a story mission for a day, and those you just pick a general mission and continue on with life. 
Mm-hmm. But in this case, I think we will go ahead and see if we can do Spider-Man's. Does whatever a Spider-Man does. This is reminding me a little of the Buell XCOM Declassified. Although in that game, there's something far better than the XCOM, the first party XCOM series, a case of we I can delegate us in agents just elsewhere. If not for Spider-Man. Time to return the favor. We'll find him. We're running facial recognition on every Ven surveillance camera. Venom was really cool in the <sighs> 90s. And then Marvel the couldn't decide what to do with them. I can't them. believe I'm saying this, but... You think Team Spooky's doing any better? It was fun in that one PS1 game. Yeah, yes, that was during the time when Venom was well, still cool. reflection on that last dactyl was... Perfect. Perhaps a Strange, don't be a dick. A level five demon alien hybrid. Where did you learn your magic, Demo Khan? You That's know, a thing. You really do have a look. Hunter's right. This isn't working. On to Plan C. Well, more like D. Norman won't mind if I borrow a few Oscorp satellites at forty-five thousand feet, right? Higher, further, faster, baby. Eighty-second and fifth. To be fair, he could probably afford, you well, know, between borrowing those. <laughs> oh, sure, the, the Guys, teens with their cell phones could find it. And they're trending. Hashtag big alien apple. <laughs> <laughs> Admittedly, I think this is really funny. Now imagine if you had just asked for help sooner. No time for an after-school special. Patching it through. <laughs> Shut up, Stork. <laughs> He's sitting with a bruised ego at the moment. Like... You mean to tell me those interns I hired would have actually been useful? We need to hurry. Oh, there's still a city last standing. Well, let's see. Spider-Man's gonna be there. Man, so, naturally. So we're stuck with him. So we've got us, we've got Spider-Man. Who do you want to bring? Right now, well, see, Stark is injured. And Captain Marvel... Kind of it's busy at the moment. See, normally the symbiotes are weak against fire, but Ghost Rider doesn't use regular fire. I kind of... I kind of want to bring Ilyana a little bit. Okay. Uh, and also so keep you... in mind that if you you look at these, these guys are level 3 and these guys are level 4. Yeah, because yeah, so... we've been using them more. Yep. So the level 3 is the leveling up. Yep. So you want to bring magic? She does look badass. badass. Combat Spidey items looks and so out of essence. place here. <laughs> yeah, a little bit. <laughs> you know, this is kind of turning into a uh, smash. <laughs> All these sword users. Uh, 